What's going on you guys? Keep on the camera here and a lot of you you've been asking me where the cooking videos are How come I haven't cooked anything in the new house yet? So I'm going to today. I'm gonna cook something that I hadn't hooked that I hadn't cooked in a while Hot dogs and I'm cooking them a little differently than you're used to seeing Check it out the first step of your hot dogs I got Hoffman's German brand Franks and natural casing now these are the brand of hot dogs used at Hides of Liverpool and I've also got their Snapper Grillers, which is their Coney's. These are a white Coney. And I'm going to cook these both in the same pan today. And here's how I'm going to do it. Now these actually smell good. Here they are. These are not like your typical Oscar Mayer. So there we go. We have the Coney's and the Franks in the same pan. Now then, the first thing I'm going to do... And we'll put in some onion. And the next step is boiling these hot dogs in Heineken. Now these aren't going to be boiled actually. I know I just said that. But I'm not going to be boiling them. I'm going to sit there and slow cook them in it. Boiling would consist of a fast boil. This is going to be a very slow process. I'm also going to add a little chicken stock. Now while those hot dogs cook, I'm going to start my chili. Starting off with a pound, this is probably a little over a pound, 1.26, but I'm going to go with it. A fresh ground meat, ground beef, ground meat. So there's a little over a pound of ground beef. To that, I'm going to be adding one third a cup of water. Now while this cooks, I'm just going to smash up the meat with a potato smasher because I want this meat to break apart really well. So we're doing two and a half teaspoons of chili powder, half a teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of black pepper, half a teaspoon of white sugar, half a teaspoon of onion powder, a dash of Worcestershire, half a can of tomato sauce, about five ounces, and half a cup ketchup. And that is everything for our chili recipe. And we're just going to cook this together. This right here is what we end up with. It is a homemade chili sauce for hot dogs. Okay, so I'm gonna check on these hot dogs. Oh yeah, it is time for the next step, buddy. These have now fully cooked in this. Don't need the broth anymore, so I'm gonna drain it. Be careful when we're doing this. All we're getting rid of is that broth. We're keeping all the onions and the hot dogs. Now we got that, toss in a little bit of butter, and we're just going to saute these up. So I boiled them in Heineken, chicken broth, and onions, and then after they're boiled, I sit here and I saute them in butter. I'm going to give a little bit of brown to them. As you can see, I got a bun inside here, just steaming. It's going to heat up a minute. And then I'm going to make myself a hot dog with the homemade chili. We got some homemade fries going. Wait, those are not homemade fries. Those are bag fries. I apologize. However, get some homemade. Yeah, this is an ice cream scooper. I'm putting the chili on with. I like my hot dog with just chili and mustard. Boom. Chili dog with homemade chili, Hodge dogs. Let's try this. Mm. Quite certainly the best hot dog I have ever made. Choosing those Hoffman dogs, it has that snap. Let's try it again. Mmm. Delicious.